guys welcome to Tesca Technologies Private Limited myself Mitali Jain and in today's session we will learn about DC programmable power supply order code is PPS4305 this power supply is used to provide the power and we can also use in this kit we can also interface it with the computer for that USB port are also provided and all the related accessories are provided CD is provided for the software. So this is our trainer kit, this is programmable DC power supply which operates at 0 to 30 volt and 0 to 5 ampere and this is its front panel. So this is its display area, this display area is display user interface and these are the direction keys. Uh, you can select the menu, select parameter and edit the cursor and these are the directional keys such as if you want to increase the value you can increase through this and through this you can decrease the value and if you want to move left and right you can move through these uh, nodes and after that these are three buttons for system memory and key lock and then after that this is the knob which is used to select the main menu and change the value function equal to the confirmation key then after that this is on off key this is to turn in and turn off the channel and after that this is the channel terminal output terminal and this is the power on off button so now talking about these three types like key lock key lock is basically used to press the press and hold this button for 5 seconds when you hear a beep then panel is locked and lock icon is displayed on the top of the screen when locked screen is pressed and any other key has no effect so this is the memory key this has five sets of channel parameter that can be stored for quick out output this is the system key it's uh, for system settings interface setting system information so this is all about our front panel now this is the rear panel and in this uh, this is our ac power input jack this is fuse here we will insert the power fuse and this is air vent and this is the communication port com port it is for usb interface we can connect it with the softwares and we can connect it with the computer system and for that uh, we can install the software and software for that is also provided in the uh, uh, in the cd so now we will switch on the supply so as you can see that led display is shown then after that we will press the on and off button so you can see that uh, these all are the option these are the settings and CV is here for CV is for constant voltage output and if current for current it would be CC constant current output it is basically actual voltage output its actual current output and its actual power output this is for buzzer status and this is for channel output status and these are all the settings this is basically used to set the value this is uh, of voltage and this is for current and this is the set value of OVP and this is a set voltage of OCP. So now when you will press the memory button so you can see that there are five memory port like M1, M2, M3, M4, M5 these all are five memory keys in which the m1 m2 m3 keys can store five sets of channel parameter which are m1 m2 m3 m4 m5 respectively for quick output and when you will press this system so you will go to this screen so this is the system setup so you can here set the utility port and the systems and uh, here it has been shown that if you want to exit then you have to click the system and these are the direction keys which you can press and for o if you would like to confirm so then you have to click the ok button so it follows as if you want to select port so you can see that board or even stop bits and this is the system configuration and now if you would like to set the voltage so you can do one thing like uh, first of all through this you can move up and down so I have uh, set it to voltage so voltage is now 10 volt if I would like to make it uh, 5 volt then I have to decrease the value so I set it 0 then after that I will set here 5 so 1, 2, 3, 
4 5 so you can see that i have set the 5 volt this device can maximally operate at 31 volts where when current is at 5 ampere so this is the maximum range of this system now we will use this multimeter to check the output on this multimeter like 5 volt will be displayed on this multimeter so for that first of all we will connect these test probes so negative in negative and positive in positive these test lead we have connected then after that we will switch on its supply so we have to set it to ac dc volt then you can see that 5 volt we have set here and this 5 volt is displayed on the multimeter and we can set also its maximum range so for that we have to uh, increase the knob we have to rotate the knob as you can see that when we are rotating the knob then voltage is also changing which is uh, seen on the display if it's 10 volt then in multimeter we are able to see 10 volt so its maximum limit can reach up to so it can maximum go till 30 volts so you can see that 30 volt is displayed on the uh, dc power supply display and we have seen the 30 volt in multimeter display so in this way we can calculate the dc power supply and use can use can uh, we can also see its programming and all these things in uh, computer system so for that the so for that cd is provided and this cable is also provided for the interfacing hence this is all about today's session for further query you can contact to tesca technologies private limited and you can also refer to our user manual thank you for watching the video